The Incredibles from 2004. Ladies and gentlemen, we got a new quick little movie series. I guess we could still call it a movie series coming at you guys, man. We are checking out the first Incredibles movie and the second Incredibles movie. Now, I can already see the comments. Right, mate. You haven't seen Incredibles? You didn't have a fucking childhood. I didn't watch a lot of movies growing up. I have seen some, you know, I've seen, I've seen some, di I've seen some animated movies and stuff like that when I was younger. You know, I've seen ne Finding Nemo. I've seen some of the Toy Story movies. I've seen Monsters Inc. Some movies I haven't seen. I haven't seen Shrek, any of them. I haven't seen The Incredibles. However, the second one recently came out a couple of years ago and I was thinking, you know, I haven't done too many animated movies on the channel. So I figured we'd throw it in the pool and turns out <laughs> this fucking destroyed the pool, man. I had, um... Texas Chainsaw Massacre in there, which, yeah, I know, the movies don't really go hand in hand, you know, we got Incredibles and we got Texas Chainsaw Massacre in the same poll, but we had Texas Chainsaw Massacre, we had The Shining, we had this, and then we had one other movie series, I forget, but regardless, the whole point, this fucking destroyed all those movies, and you guys wanted to see me react to it, man, I have heard a lot of good things about Incredibles over the years, I've seen, like, you know, little clips and trailers and stuff like that from it. So I kind of have an idea of like how it looks in the animation, everything like that. But it really never just appealed to me as I got older. And obviously I didn't watch it when I was younger. So it's just a movie I never checked out. However, I've heard amazing things about the first one. I heard the second one is pretty good, but I've also heard some bad things about it. But I feel like that's with any movie series that we check out here on the channel, man. Regardless, guys, I'm going into this essentially completely blind. You know, so maybe this will lead us checking out some more animated movies in the future. I've been having a lot of people ask me to do Shrek and uh, stuff like that. Like I said, I've seen Finding Nemo. I've seen Monsters, Inc. I've seen some of the Toy Story movies. And I've seen a handful of others that I can't really think of right now. But I'm super excited for this, guys. So I'm going to stop wasting time. We're going to go ahead. We're going to hop into this movie. Before we do, I do ask if you guys are on a new channel, you do hit that subscribe button. Comment down below what you guys want to see next, man. Drop a like on the video for your boy. Full reaction will be up on Patreon as well as early access to a bunch of other stuff. I'm doing. If you guys want to check that out, link in the description down below. We're going to go ahead. We're going to hop into this movie. Good old Pixar, man. It's been a minute since I've watched a Pixar movie in general. I'm trying to think of the last one I watched, but... Shit. It's been years, man. It's been years. It's been years. Every superhero has a secret identity. I don't know a single one who doesn't. Who wants the pressure of being super all the time? <laughs> of course I have a secret identity. Can you see me in this at the, um, at the, at the supermarket? <laughs> Come on. I would want to go shopping as Elastigirl, you know what I mean? Writing down the character names. Settle down. Are you kidding? I'm at the top of my game. I'm right up there with the big dogs. Girls, come on. Leave the saving of the world to the men? I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think so. It's so funny hearing all the different perspectives on being a superhero from the different people. You know what I mean? Oh, this is going to be good. I'm excited for it, man. Damn, okay. Yeah, I've got time. <laughs> Autopilot on, baby. It's Tesla before Tesla was a thing. <laughs> Jesus. Okay. Okay. Mr. Incredible or Mr. Incredible. <laughs> Lady, get the fuck out the road. What is it, ma'am? My Casquica won't come down. Uh... It's quite tight. The <laughs> <laughs> motherfucker really stopped a superhero to get her damn cat. <laughs> and okay that kind of worked out ready for takeoff what the who are you supposed to be well i'm incredible boy. what no <laughs> you're that kid from the fan club <laughs> bro Bro, Brody, but buddy, buddy. Uh, My name is Incredible Boy. I am your number one fan. <laughs> yeah, get the fuck out the car. Hey, hey, wait. <laughs> Dude has super fans, man. Holy shit, that's hilarious. I was just thinking the other day too how they used to always show cats stuck in trees in movies, and nowadays they don't. <laughs> hey, look. <laughs> 
Whatever happened to ladies first? Well, whatever happened to equal treatment? Hey, look, wait. The lady got me first. <laughs> Flexible. The fuck? Are you doing anything later? I have a previous engagement. Yo, she showed that flexibility, my man said. <laughs> you doing anything later? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Bro, that looked so weird. <laughs> now you just stay oh. here. They usually pick up the garbage and... There we go! You broke something! <laughs> well, with counseling, I think you'll come to forgive me. Yeah, what the fuck? Wait a minute. You literally would it. Oh my god. I get what he was trying to do, but like, you're gonna say he broke something and complain about that? Oh. My man always got time, huh? <laughs> I love the way the characters look. Bon voyage. <laughs> oh my god. How the fuck did he get up here? Oh. Hey. How I get around so fast? See, I have these rocket boots. Go oh home, buddy. My God. Now. So I'll show you. I'll go get the police. Buddy, oh, go. God. It'll only take a second, really. No, stop. There's a bomb. Oh my God, dude. Dude, this is about to get dark. <laughs> my man wants to be a superhero so bad, bro. I was so confused how the fuck he got all the way up there. Damn. Now we're gonna have another problem to solve, aren't we? <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh uh, listen i've got to be somewhere he ran out of time finally my man just handled like five criminals at once you guys can handle one person bomb voyage come on now incredible he really hey, fucked everything up didn't he You're very late how do i look good oh the mask you still got the mask <laughs> you need to be more flexible <laughs> shut the fuck up we're gonna make this work you gotta be more than Mr. Incredible. We're superheroes. What could happen? <laughs> Lots of shit could happen. What you mean? In a Mr. Incredible sued? Hero is being sued for saving someone who apparently didn't. Oh want my to god. The, plaintiff the dude who was jumping. Incredible's court losses cost the government millions. Oh my god. And open the floodgates for dozens of superhero lawsuits the world over. It is wow. Time. This is fucked up, man. Quietly and anonymously continuing to make the world a better place. Uh, so you really just don't want Didn't superheroes? I? That's crazy how you much shit happened. I don't understand. Look at him. I have four 15 I'm years. Sorry, Mrs. Claims, Dude, I didn't realize him and Elastigirl were getting married we that quick. <laughs> yeah, well, I really thought that was their first time meeting. <laughs> I don't know how he does it. He, but, but, but there's no attack on my stool before he moves. And after he moves, there's attack. Coincidence? I think not. <laughs> this dude, man, it's all over the top. Bernie. Don't Bernie me. Bernie. This little rat is guilty. You're letting him go again? He's guilty. He has powers, I'm guessing. His name's Dash. He's probably fast as fuck, huh? I'm fast as fuck, boy. Oh, he said our powers were nothing to be ashamed of. Our powers made us special. Everyone's special, Dash. Which is another way of saying no one is. <laughs> Damn. I never thought of it like that. That's kind of fucked up, man. Oh. They need to have, like, some crazy fucking supervillain come out. And then that's when they want the fucking superheroes back. <laughs> oh, shit. She has powers, too. What the fuck? He looked at me. No, he didn't. I, I mean, I guess, but no, <laughs> that's their other kid. <laughs> yep, just walk it off like nothing happened. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? God damn. Barely see it on the tape. They caught you on tape and you still got away with it? Whoa. <laughs> you must have been booking. How fast do you think you were going? We were not in Honey! Damn. <laughs> okay, I'm ready. Oh, oh, oh my god, dude. This is chaos. Hey, hello. Hey, Bye. Hey. Jack Jack. Ice of you to drop by. Ice of you. Is this Mr. Freeze? 
He starts monologuing. He starts <laughs> monologuing. They he don't starts bowl. like this they sit here and relive the glory how days, huh? I am compared to him, how <laughs> inevitable my defeat is. What if we actually did what our wives think we're doing? <laughs> just to shake things. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to relive the glory days. Yeah, oh my god, dude. Their outfits. What the fuck? Damn. Took the whole building down. You better hope you got everybody out. <laughs> I want I you know, to. I know. Freeze. Freeze. <laughs> you better get the hell out, bitch. Why? Why what? Be specific, Bob. Why are you unhappy? Your customers make me unhappy. Why? <laughs> You've gotten complaints? Complaints? I can handle. He needs help. Do not change the subject. Bob. My man does not care about people who need help. He is getting mugged. Well, let's hope we don't cover up. Right <laughs> Insurance companies are the worst, man. We were this close to losing your team. Damn! My man got thrown through one, two, uh -oh. three, four walls? Holy shit. Well, I hope you don't have insurance with your company. <laughs> Man is so unhappy. Just not doing what you're supposed to do in life. You know what I mean? This is why you got to pursue what you want to do in life. You know? You ain't going to be happy doing something you ain't supposed to be doing with your life. Mm, it's from that one lady, huh? This message is classified and will not be repeated. I represent the top secret division of the government. Designing this mission is not all It's time for exist. dinner. One minute. <laughs> if you accept, your payment will be triple your current annual salary. Or you can listen to police scammers. Your choice. <laughs> you have 24 hours to respond. <clears throat> Think about it. Damn. Perfect timing, too, with him getting fired and stuff, but it does seem sus. You know what I mean? On safety. How am I going in? The Omnidroid's defenses necessitate an airdrop from 5,000 feet. You want me to shut it down without completely destroying Damn. it? You are Mr. Incredible. Didn't she say she has powers, too? Why can't she fucking help? He's, uh... It's it's been a while. He's put on a few pounds. <laughs> Definitely not gonna be what it used to be. I'm sure my man is probably out of shape, out of practice. <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> oh, there it is. Shit. How do you shut this thing off or down without destroying it? Even finding something that can adapt, I feel like, would be the most annoying thing. Motherfucker's a ball of death. Dude, fuck the mission. I'm worried about dying. Oh. Damn. <laughs> Bro, how's this thing not dead? <laughs> My man pulled his back now, too. He's really fucked. Oh. <laughs> it cracked his back for it, man. Homeboy's a chiropractor. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Now it's time to do some real damage. Or let it just destroy itself. Shit. Now how are we getting out of this? Mission success. Shit. Mm. Of course this was a setup, man. I told you this seemed a little bit sus. Wow. <laughs> yeah, if anybody sees him doing that shit, he's fucked. My man cannot even go to a normal gym. They ain't got enough weights for him. What is it? Who are you? What do you want? My god, you've gotten fat. <laughs> <laughs> My god, you've gotten fat? Who the fuck is this? His cape snagged on a missile pin. Damn. Damn. That was not the brightest ball. Stratogale, April 23rd, 57. Oh god. Cape caught in a jet turbine. Oh my. Yo, that is dark. Meta Man, Express Elevator, Diner Guy, Snag on Takeoff, Splashdown, Sucked into a Vortex. No kicks. Mm, I don't think the Vortex was related to the cape. Fine. I will also fix the hollow <laughs> You're the best of the best, Yes, e. I know, darling. <laughs> I know. 
<laughs> of course, man. She used to do uh, hero suits and stuff like that. Every superhero show or movie needs somebody who designs them, right? My man got shrimp your cocktail. You're welcome. My man is living lavish now, man. His suit looking clean. Gonna see it patched up. Yes, it's been a while. Bob, 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 Bob suit. I'm calling about Bob suit. You come in one hour, darling. I insist. Okay, okay. Goodbye. Man, she really knows how to get him, huh? <laughs> he is fucking hilarious. God damn. These big ass tables, man. There's only three people here, right? That one dude, him, and Mirage. Oh my god. Motherfucker's back. What the fuck? It's finally ready. Oh you know, shit. It's Incrediboy, it right? Good enough. After you trashed the last one, I had to make some major modifications. Sure, it was difficult. What the fuck? <laughs> How do you think I got rich? I invented weapons, and now I have a weapon that only I can. And when I unleash it, I'll get <laughs> Damn. You sly dog. You got me monologuing. <laughs> this dude has invented some crazy shit. Holy hell. Damn, man. Super he really created his own super villain, huh? Your nemesis in it. How brilliant. Is he trying to see what it's looking toward? Chronos? Searching for him, scanning. Light rating negative, Mr. Incredible terminated. <laughs> I mean, you might want to be sure, you know what I'm saying? Will retain its shape. Wow. Virtually indestructible. She made suits for all of them. That's crazy. That's one way to get inside. <laughs> Is the password password? I guess that worked. <laughs> Damn, he's been hunting them all down, huh? He's been having them all come to the island and shit, and he's just having them all get killed. Damn, he's gonna send it to a city, huh? Wow. This dude is just like next level evil, holy shit. Damn, she really fucked him, huh? What the fuck? I guess that's one way to stop somebody. Shit. Dude, that would be terrifying, man. Holy hell. What do you need? A jet. What do you got that's fast? Let me think. <laughs> oh, dude, the whole family's about to come, huh? Let me find out. Oh, Ew. she's ready. Violet, it's not Damn. my fault. Dash ran away, and I knew I'd get blamed for it, and I yeah, thought no. he tried to sneak away. <laughs> <laughs> <out. laughs> <laughs> of, of course they came in. in. Face of maneuvers. Hey, she's been out of <laughs> she, she she's been out of the game for a minute, but she still got it on the flying, huh? Damn. I thought she was gonna get the force field last minute. Release me now. <laughs> Show me. He's not gonna do it to her, I don't think. And I've outgrown you. Damn. I think Mirage is gonna end up helping uh Mr. Incredible, you know. To trust me. She's been in action a lot of times before, <laughs> you know. Oh my god, man. Look at this makeshift boat. Dude, this is insane. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh my god. <laughs> All the different shapes she can like go into is so like crazy, man. You know, it can just stretch her body. <laughs> hey. 
That works, I guess. Oh my god, she's trapped in what? Three different doors? <laughs> <laughs> Look at that shit, man. Oh my gosh. <laughs> well, shit. <clears throat> <laughs> she found where he's at, though. Mirage is gonna set him free, huh? Yep, I knew it. <laughs> he's like, I'm sorry. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Damn. Hello. Oh my God. <laughs> She was helping the me timing. to escape. No. Bring them, they start away, and I don't think you're striking the proper <laughs> Of course she walked in at that exact moment, man. You know what I'm saying? My man Dash is fucking moving. Oh my god, that is disgusting. Ugh, 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 ugh. Hey, he's taking him out. Maybe not on purpose, but hey. Hey. <laughs> God, dude. All them working together, their powers in sync are just insane, huh? God, and then this fucking dude again. Sell my invention so that everyone can be superheroes. Everyone can be super. And when everyone's super, <laughs> no one will be. <laughs> God, here we go. Here's the giant thing. They all need superheroes to stop. Out of this safe well, place. I think Dad has made some excellent progress today, <laughs> but I think it's time we wind down now. <laughs> <laughs> Where is my super suit? This is the meme I always see, man. Where? Why do you need to know? I am your wife. Oh my god. Good you are ever gonna get. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, dude. You love to fucking see it, man. I've seen that meme so many fucking times. It's hilarious. And here comes Incredible Boy. God, dude. This shit looks so staged. It adapts, man. That's right. It learns to adapt. Look, he said, fuck this, I'm out. What a fucking sorry excuse. Jesus, man. His own invention. I'm not, not what? I'm, I'm not strong enough. Strong enough, and this will make you stronger? Yes. No. That's what this is, some sort of workout? <laughs> I can't lose you again. We're superheroes. What could happen? <laughs> <laughs> I guess he is strong enough, shit. <laughs> He's not gonna be able to beat him the same way as last time. Hey, Frozone! Frozone in the house! Hey, Frozone is moving, man. Look at him. Go ahead, okay? Bro, this thing is so overpowered. The only thing hard enough to penetrate it is itself. Try to buy some time. Try the one next to it. Yo, Frozone is badass, man. Everybody Damn. That was a good shot. Straight through the heart. The center. Everybody suddenly happy that the fucking heroes are back. Huh? No. God, dude, I fucking that? hate this dude's face. <laughs> it pisses me off. Sorry for freaking out, but your baby has special needs. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Pretending a replacement citizen. 
Replacement? I didn't call a replacement. Oh, shit. What's his name, huh? Yeah. The baby's sleeping. Dude, I fucking... <laughs> oh, my God. This motherfucker's so annoying. In my future, I'm simply returning the favor. Oh, don't worry. I'll be a good mentor. Supportive, encouraging. Everything you weren't. And in time, who knows? He might make a good sidekick. This dude is so fucking annoying. His face... Just his look pisses me off. It's so annoying. Something's happening. What's happening? That's why she was freaking out on the phone, huh? Holy shit. We have to stop him. Throw something. I can't. I might hit Jack Jack. <laughs> oh my god. Throw me. Dude, the baby has some badass powers. What the fuck? Those might be the best powers in the family. This shit. Is the end of it. I will get your son eventually! I'll get your son! The cape! <laughs> the cape, everything came full circle. God, dude, that's like death, death. Thank God, shit. That dude is annoying as hell, man. Finally. She's learning. That's my girl. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta pace it good. Another problem already? Goddamn. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh my god. Not on my watch. Oh my god. Oh my god, man. What a fucking movie. The Incredibles from 2004. Ladies and gentlemen, it's in the fucking books. This shit was fantastic, man. I fucking love it. I see why so many people love this fucking movie. I've always heard, like, amazing things about The Incredibles. People saying, like, it's one of their favorite movies. And when Incredibles 2 was coming out, I remember so much hype was behind it. And I just never really understood why. Because, like, eh, it's just, you know, it's another animated Pixar movie. And don't get me wrong. Pixar movies are fantastic. You know what I mean? But they weren't anything I ever personally kind of freaked out or was excited for you know what i mean like i said i've seen like finding nemo i've seen some of the toy stories not all of them you know i've seen some animated movies here and there when i was younger and stuff and i liked them but it wasn't like anything crazy for you got about but this movie was fucking good man you know it wasn't like corny or weird at any spots it was just it was hilarious it had good action and it had good messages in it too you know like so many people i feel like I, I, okay, obviously, you know, this is a movie, this is a little bit different level, you know, they got superpowers and everything like that, but you see the dude, you know, he's, he, he was happy, Mr. Incredible was happy, living his life, saving people, using his powers, doing what he was kind of born to do, essentially, right, and I know sometimes I get, you know, with these, I go on these little rants, but, um, he, he was happy doing what he was supposed to do. And then when he couldn't anymore and he was stuck doing a job he hated, doing something he hated, not doing what he felt like was his kind of purpose in life. He was sad. He was unhappy. He, he wasn't spending time with his family. He wasn't happy with his wife and everything like that. And it's because he wasn't doing what he was supposed to do. He didn't feel like he had a purpose anymore, you know? And then when he started doing that again, his whole attitude changed. He was happy, spending time with his wife, loving his wife, spending time with his kids, happy in life and everything, man. And it just goes to show you, man, I know this is a movie again, but you take that into real life, man. So many people out there are unhappy, depressed, and sad. And it's not always, you know, there's different reasons sometimes, but a lot of the times it's just because so many people are focused on, you know, trying to stay afloat and do what, you know, kind of society has kind of pushed on them or the family has pushed on them or school has pushed on them or do whatever, you know, job provides the best money as opposed to doing something they enjoy, something that they're good at, something that they love to do. You know what I mean? Like you can have a job and enjoy doing it. There's plenty of people out there who, you know, do what they love to do for a living and not even necessarily just like, you know, famous people or basketball players or YouTubers or anything like that. Like some people are born to be construction workers. Some people are born to be nurses. Some people are born to be, you know, fill in the blank. So many different people are born to do different things on the earth, man. You just got to find what you love to do and how to make money doing it. And a big, 
when you do that, you know, a lot will change, man. You'll be happier around other stuff. You know, it'll affect all different aspects of your life. Cause I can tell you what, prior to, you know, doing all this, when I was just at my other job, I wasn't doing this at all. And I just kind of felt like I was stuck kind of just going through the motions again, kind of like, Kind of like a zombie you know like a lot of people nowadays are just zombies they wake up they go to work they come home they eat dinner they have their two hours where they get to relax they go to sleep and they repeat the process five days a week and they're so like depressed and they get stuck in that cycle man you know and you're just like damn what the fuck is life is this you know what's the point you gotta break free of that you gotta do what you love and i feel like you know this movie had that kind of message in it you know it might not have been you know, a message that everybody takes from it, but that's the message I took from it, man. And then on top of that, it was just a good, wholehearted, funny movie. Again, incredible. <laughs> I didn't expect him to be the fucking villain. It makes sense though, because you know, they say a lot of times, you know, heroes sometimes create their arch nemesis or their villains, whether it's like in this case, their super fan that they kind of not even necessarily ignored because he said he signed picture he, he took pictures he signed autographs and everything like that he just wouldn't let the dude help him which is obvious he's a fucking kid you know what i mean but so many times they say that they create it whether it's like their friend that they left or you know an old person they did wrong or something like that and came, comes back for him i didn't expect it to be incredible <laughs> that shit was that shit was crazy but the look of him i don't know why just the way they designed his face his hair his voice Every time the motherfucker came on screen, pissed me off, man. I don't know. You know how there's some people in life that you just kind of see and just, you get, they just irritate you. You know what I mean? Like some people on screen, you see them, you're just like, damn, they're fucking annoying. That's what this dude was like for me, man. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it was the design of his character. I don't know if it was the look. I don't know what the fuck it was. But every time he came on screen, oh my God, dude was so annoying, man. Homeboy really created this big ass robot that could adapt to anything, literally anything. And he thought he was going to come stop it. Like it wasn't going to adapt to him. You know, it seemed that he was controlling it with his little wristbands. So the robot took out his wristbands. God, man. And then Jack Jack ends up having powers toward the end too. Like, I don't know exactly what his powers are. The dude kind of shape shift a little bit. He turned his body to like metal. He turned his body on fire. Like, I don't know exactly what his powers are, but I mean, maybe they'll explore it more in the second. If they do, I feel like his powers might be the best out of everybody's. If he can like shape shift and turn his body to different like materials, like stone, metal, fire, maybe liquid. I don't know, but that's kind of what he did there. He turned it to fire, then metal, then he shape shift into like a little beast. Like, holy shit, man. Jack Jack might have the best fucking powers out of everybody. God damn. I mean, Violet's powers are dope. She can go invisible. She can create force fields, you know, dash. She can run insanely quick. Those are cool and everything. Don't get me wrong, but jack jack might have the have the best powers out of everybody even out of you know mr incredible and elastigirl and then frozone dude frozone funny as fuck i've seen that meme so many times and i knew it was from this movie but i just never seen it like in play with the movie that shit is fucking hilarious oh my god man what a movie i fucking loved it this makes me want to watch so many more animated you know pixar movies because i'm sure there's a ton i haven't seen but regardless, guys, we will be checking out Incredibles 2 next week. Let me know what you guys thought about it in the comment section down below. Like always, also, if you guys did enjoy this reaction video, make sure to leave a like if you guys are new to the channel. Hit that subscribe button for reaction to be up on Patreon as well as early access to a bunch of other stuff I'm doing. If you guys want to check that out, link in the description down below. I hope you all have a wonderful day, and I'll see you in the next one. What is going on, everybody? I hope you did all just enjoy the reaction that you checked out. If you did, make sure to drop a like on the video and comment down below a movie or TV series that you guys want to see me react to next. I want to give a couple quick shout outs to some of my highest supporters over on Patreon. Shout out to the homie Silas Kane, That's So Gordo, Supernova, and the homie Quentin. I appreciate you guys for supporting me over on Patreon, man, as well as everybody else. So if you guys want to join the Patreon family, the link is on screen right now, as well as in the description down below. You guys get access to early access videos, full length reactions, and a bunch of other stuff. Come join the Patreon family. Hopefully you guys all have a wonderful day, and I'll see you in the next one.